Good day everyone and welcome to my channel. How are you guys today? Uh, before we uh, proceed to what are we going to talk about today, I would like to say let me let me try it in Dutch because we're going to talk about Miss Belgium 2020 today. This one. I'm going to try it. It's uh, Who didn't Doug? Who didn't Doug? <laughs> Who didn't Doug everyone? Okay, so there you go. I've learned that today. I'm Hooden Dunk everyone and welcome to my channel and of course before we continue I would like you to subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click the notification bell so that you will be updated to my next video. Anyway, today we are going to talk about the newly crowned Miss Belgium, Miss Belgium 2020. Her name is Miss Celine Van Uitzel. Okay, correct me if I'm wrong. I had never, I have never pronounced, um, what do you call this, a Dutch word, aside from Vandam, <laughs> Jean-Claude Vandam. <laughs> so, uh, her name is Miss Celine van Oetziel, Uts so this girl is going to represent her country and in the Miss Universe 2020 at the same time at the Miss World 2020. So congratulations to you, Celine. And I think you will really, really do good because uh, you are gorgeous. Her height is also amazing. She's 5'8". And uh, at the same time, Celine also is a law graduate. So I think she's a very, she's a very educated contestants and i think with that that is going to be her weapon in the miss universe 2020. miss belgium 2020 is a 24 years old gorgeous lady and um she actually thinks or she's really really famous in in her country because she is very famous in the social media a lot of people knows about her and uh, during the Miss Belgium 2020, act, something happened during the finals. She actually fell on the stage because there was a bra on the stage. I don't know where it came from. I was looking at the at the videos and all of a sudden there was a bra underneath her gown and it just that made her trip off the stage. So so I don't know where it came from. I don't know if it came from her or I don't know if it came from the the gown itself that she didn't know it was hanging inside the gown and that made her trip you know so um anyway she really gave a, a good what you call this a good performance miss belgium um so far in the history of miss universe they didn't win any miss universe title yet so maybe maybe celine would be the first ever miss belgium to get the crown for her country who knows because these days we know that um Miss Universe is not all about beauty. It's all about how smart you are, how relatable you are. It's not all about the model-like kind of figure, unlike the Trump era. This day, it's all about how confident you are to speak your mind, how witty you are, how, as I said, how relatable you are to the public or to the women of the world. Celine also portrays herself as the lady from um, the movie Legally Blonde because like Elle Woods, um, she is also a lawyer and of course she's also blonde so she thinks that her life is kind of like the same as the life of Elle Woods. We all know Legally Blonde, right? It's, it's one of my favorite movies and, uh, and I also like what about the, uh, the actress which is Miss Reese Witherspoon. She's, she's one of my favorite actress ever. So. That's what she's thinking, that she's portraying the life of Elwoods in real life. I think also as being a law graduate, that is going to be her edge in order to be, you know, in order to be in the top, uh, in the top, top 20 of the Miss Universe 2020. And, and from there, we don't know what's going to happen because you really have to talk. You really have to speak your mind when you're in Miss Universe and not just speaking your mind, but it's, it has to, to be like something that has substance. You know what I mean? So as for now, I'm excited for Miss Belgium and I can't wait what she can bring into the table. I think, I think she is 
gorgeous. She is, she is relatable. And it's been such a long time that the Miss Universe organization have a ground a blonde woman so maybe this is going to be her year this is going to be the year of the blonde girls because last year it was the the black woman you know it was miss Zuzubini Tonzi from South Africa who got the crown so maybe this year it's, it's been such a long time that they that they they crowned a blonde Miss Universe maybe it'll be Miss Belgium who knows so far on my list I think Miss Belgium Miss uh Celine Van, Van Oitzel is going to, to be at least on a top 15. That's the, her highest placement for now, I think. But who knows, based on her performance. So if you agree on what I was saying, just let me know. And if not, just comment down your section below and let me know. And I was also looking on the question and answer portion for the Miss Belgium 2020, but I can't see anything on YouTube. So if you know anything about the question and answer portion, maybe you could write the link down below and I could click on it and see her performance of the question and answer portion. When it comes to pageantry, Miss Belgium is not the first pageant that Celine have ever joined. Um, joined the Miss Antwerp 2016, where she placed second runner up. So she's kind of like a veteran when it comes to to beauty pageant and uh, she she joined already this big pageant in her country so i think that's also one of her edge in order for her to win the miss universe 2020 so that's what i can say for today um that's for miss belgium 2020 she's gonna join the miss universe and miss world 2020 uh, sometimes I don't understand why some of these countries just crown one lady to join two major pageants in the world, the Miss Universe and uh, Miss World. So it seems like it's too much pressure for the girl. But at the same time, it, I think it's fun because you were able to, to what do you call this, to represent your country for the two big pageants of the world, which is Miss World and Miss Universe. But if I were the pageant director of the country, I would just designate one big pageant to one contestant so that she can just focus on it not like two major pageants you know what i mean because at least with that you can really focus and you can really really aim high and then just focus on miss universe if you're going to the miss universe or if you can just focus on miss world then you can just focus on miss world not just like two big pageants so it's like you know what i'm talking about that's just my thought about it so do you agree guys that you could win a top 20 or if not, you think she's going to win the Miss Universe 2020 or she's not going to make it at all to the top 20 or what do you think? Just share your, your comments below. Let us know. Good luck to you, Celine. And I think you can do it. I think you have the, the, you have the brain, you have the beauty, you got what it takes. Just be prepared for this big pageant of your life, okay? And for those of you guys who have been subscribed to my channel, don't forget to, to subscribe. Subscribe and don't forget to click the notification bell so that you'll be updated to my next video, okay? Thank you so much, everyone. And I would like to say, Tootzins!